Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Hi Sagittarius Fire Sign. Today I am going to do general reading. May or may not resonate everyone. So take what resonates and leave the rest. If you like my content, please do like the video guys. Then it will reach more people. And thank you so much for supporting me. If anyone wants a personal reading, comment me in comment box and it is chargeable. So let's see your messages. First we will see general messages regarding your career and finances. Then we will see love messages. Sagittarius, Fire Sign, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. <clears throat> so your recent past your present future your present energy queen of pentacles under the deck page of cups Sagittarius, right now you are focusing on your career. Yes, Queen of Pentacles. At the same time, you are balancing your work life and home life also. But you want stability in your finances. You want to be financially very, very stable. So that's why you're really working hard to achieve your financial goals. And under the deck, we got here Page of Cups. So you want to start something new again. So right now you got success in one area, one uh, career area of your life. Now you want to start something new. So you are thinking about new opportunities. And you are planning for something big here. You have very big plans right now, Sagittarius. So recent past, Queen of Swords, Three of Swords. So in recent past, uh, you were sad and you took your power back. And you set and maintain boundaries with other people. Maybe you lost some opportunity. Uh, you lost your uh, your money or you lose your job. Uh, but you were sad. But you were not emotionally weak. Uh, maybe you were weak but you uh, don't want to show uh, your feelings to anyone. So Queen of Swords means you set and maintain boundaries. Present two of cups with the sun. So right now things are changing. I'm seeing uh, the sun card. Uh, you came out of the past completely. Now you are completely in the present and you're focusing on your career and you're finding balance within yourself. And the sun, definitely you are getting success. You are getting new opportunities, the sun card. So if not, you will. So be in a receiving mode because the sun card means material success, happiness, abundance. So be in a receiving mode. And focus inward rather than outward because everything is within you. Okay. Future the world with king of swords. In future some cycle will end. Some new cycle is going to be begin. At the same time you will think very logically. I think uh, in these recent times Sagittarius you are not thinking emotionally anymore. You are trying to think logically here. Because king of swords. So you will apply strategies in your career. Which is very good. I'm seeing a new cycle. So let's see. What is the advice for you regarding your career and finances? Two of Swords. Ten of Pentacles and Nine of Pentacles. Yes, you want financial stability. You are really working hard. You want to be financially independent. But for that, you need to make a decision. Uh, 
uh, you need to make a very clear decision because two, two of swords means you are at some crossroads you want to make a decision but you are uh, holding back here or you are unable to make a decision so decision making is the key here so let's see love messages So your person current thoughts and your current thoughts your person present energy and your present energy under the deck nine of phones some of you are dealing with the capricorn virgo chorus lot of earth energy Sagittarius, your person is overthinking here, nine of swords energy. Definitely they are missing you a lot. I am seeing lots of you both are not talking. There is a communication gap between you and your person. So your person is thinking about you, missing you a lot, thinking about reconciliation and the waiting for your communication for sure because seven of pentacles. But five of pentacles, they are feeling that you intentionally not talking to them. Uh, so they are feeling that you ghosted them and they are overthinking. And they are thinking about the reconciliation and your current feelings you took your power back the empress energy you are trying to balance your feelings and emotions and you want to spend your time with your family because you want to heal yourself or right now you are giving more priority to your family than your person and high priestess yes you are hiding your feelings uh, and you are trying to listening to your intuition and trusting your inner voice So let's see you post the next action. So you pose a next action. Queen of Cups, Three of Pentacles and Nine of Cups and Temperance. So yes, uh, they're wishing for this connection. They're ready to work on this relationship. They do love you. But they are patiently waiting for the right opportunity to take action. Some of you are dealing with uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Water Sign or Sagittarius, Fire Sign and the lovers. Some of you are dealing with Gemini. Your person is very, very attractive to you. They are waiting for your communication. But action-wise, they are trying to control their emotions right now. So let's see what is the near future outcome of this relationship and where this relationship is headed on. Eight of Cups, Six of Pentacles and Ten of Wands under the deck Four of Pentacles. See, I'm seeing a lot of issues here, especially you both are feeling emotionally overburdened. There is no equal give and take. In near future also, I'm seeing unbalance in this connection. So here patience is the key. So let's clarify the outcome. Yeah, foundation of this relationship is very, very strong, very, very weak, sorry. And I'm seeing a lot of domination in this connection. You both want to control the situation and you both, uh, you both don't want to adjust uh, and not making any decision. So I'm seeing 
no upgrade in this relationship to be honest with you yes they are waiting for your communication but i'm seeing no upgrade in this relationship to be honest with you lot of domination some of you are dealing with capricorn it's sign so let's say energy oracle messages financial constraints so some of you right now you are facing some financial issues you need to take care of your finances and rest and rejuvenation you need to take some rest sagittarius an angel of love love yourself first and your angels has your back you and your loved ones are safe new moon in cancer so if you both are in long distance relationship or you are uh, living in different city and your family is living in different city the message here is you and your loved ones are safe and the, your dreams need a practical plan full moon in taurus so if you are dreaming about something big first you need a practical plan then you need to execute that plan successfully and a new romantic cycle begins new moon in libra so this is the reading for you guys hope it resonates to you please do share like and subscribe my channel and click the bell icon then you will get all my video notifications thank you so much for watching and supporting me please do like the video guys thank you